Welcome back to my page, you guys. I want to give a quick shout out to Cali Baby 01. I love her channel, you guys. I've seen a couple of her videos, and she has a phenomenal personality. So if you have not checked out her channel, definitely check out her channel and show her some love and subscribe. All right, baby. So let's get into today's video. Let's go. My initial review of the Shea Moisture Black Castor Oil line. So stay tuned, you guys. All right, you guys, so I was in my local store and I decided to pick up me a few items from the Shea Moisture Black Jamaican Castor Oil line. And so today's review is going to be about the leave-in conditioner. So this is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen, Grow, and Restore Leave-In Conditioner with Shea Butter peppermint and carotene all things in which are good for your hair anybody with natural hair chemically processed hair color treated hair can use this product this is a 16 floral ounce so you get a lot of bang for your this butt. product costs no more than what the other shea moisture products cost so it's so I mean you're really getting a lot for your money here um I like this product because it is a leave-in conditioner of course but it helps softens and detangles your hair um, while in which promoting healthier hair growth okay you guys I love this product I have tried this product um, in fact I used it as a um, I used it as a freshener for my mini twist of course in which I'm wearing today yeah and um so far i think i like it um i like that it has organic shea butter because all of us know what shea butter is all about shea butter helps nourish and shea butter helps to deepen moisture within your hair strands so a lot of us especially that are in the natural hair community community definitely utilize a lot of shea butter so it's always great when we have a product that has that in there because we know that our hair is going to get moisture also it has black jamaican castor oil in which we are all familiar with black jamaican castor oil does or what castor oil in general does which is promote healthier thicker hair growth and lastly it has peppermint in it peppermint stimulates the scalp which helps promote happy healthier hair growth so this we love product, those things if you're wondering what it smells like the sense of this product is a faint peppermint smell if you're familiar with um certain products you know that it may have a very strong minty scent to it which mints is not a bad thing but some people don't like walking around smelling like mint so it is such a breath of fresh air that this does not have the strong minty smell also let's get into texture you guys because you know i'm all about my senses touch and smell is very important to me this is what the texture of this product look like if you can see it there this product if you are familiar with which you should be if you know what pancake batter texture is like especially if you have too much water in it then this is what this kind of reminds you of pancake batter um, but it's not edible so don't eat it um, so it's, it's so it is extremely lightweight. Now, I was one of those girls that was on a bandwagon with the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner or the Cantu Argan Oil um, Leave-In Conditioner, which is great. Can't hate on that product, but there's no comparison to that with this because the texture for one is altogether different. And thus far, I think I may prefer this over the Cantu Leave-In Conditioner. You know, to each its own, but. I I think I might prefer this thus far um but yeah that's pretty much it it nourishes it repairs and it grows your hair which are all things that us ladies love to be able to no silicones no parabens no gluten no none of those bad things that are harmful for our hair so it is very very hair friendly so um yeah so far I think I like this product um, as you guys know, I have been on the Black Jamaican Castor Oil Challenge for a while now because I'm trying to definitely grow my hair. And I have seen some growth. However, I'm so happy to include this in my Castor Oil Challenge. So I think I may extend that even longer. I'm going to um, continue my 
routine with my regular black castor oil but I'm going to include this and see how far I come after 30 days and I'll definitely follow up with you guys so yeah um so that's my initial review so I hope that I was able to help a lot of you guys out there if you still have questions about this product feel free to leave me a comment down below and I have no problem with um, answering your questions as it relates to this product. I will see you guys in the next video. But before I go, I want to say peace.